I just wanted to make that face. So, anyway. Like my hat. It says M-A-D-D-O-G. That's my name, Mad Doll. So, anyway. Um, tonight I wanted to talk about something. Something serious. Notice how I never act serious in a serious video at the beginning of a video because I want to lighten up the video. We should do like, I don't know how to, but we should do one of those things at the bottom of the screen. There are like word counts for the number of times she says video. Oh, there it was again. So anyway, you know what really, really, really gets under my skin? When I'm like talking to someone one of my friends and they say oh is that kid gay a that is not your business okay like you don't just go up to someone and go like oh does that kid like have a crush on that kid because honestly that doesn't happen anymore and maybe when you're in kindergarten but that doesn't happen anymore in ninth grade because you, you, it's their own business. It's their own business. Who they like, who they're attracted to, who they want to be friends with, why they want to be friends with them, why they like someone, whatever. Okay? Two. Normally, when someone says this to me, it's usually because they're basing it off of something. Like a voice. If someone has a lisp, doesn't mean that they're gay okay listen to me because i know a lot of gay people with lisps and i know a lot of people who aren't gay with lisps it doesn't mean that you're gay if you have a lisp that's a stereotype and you know that goes along with bullying because if you're the blonde girl and you keep saying this to me and you because i'm blonde but anyway that's not the point if you come up to me and you're like insulted because someone thought you were some slutty bimbo just because you were blonde, you'd be insulted because that's an old stereotype. But at the same time, you're going around. I'm not saying all blondes are like homophobes, but I'm just saying like giving you an example. But then you go around and like discriminate against gay people and like just make up all these stupid stereotypes for them. Like, gay people aren't aliens, and they're not much different from, from you. But it's like, why is it your business? Like, why do you have to surround all of this with, like, their sexuality, okay? It doesn't make any sense, and no one really cares. Because, honestly, with celebrities, I get that. In the media, I get that. Because that is part of, like, where this all comes from. But, you know, no one, like like it's it's not fun when you're tormented every day for being something you're not and then it's also not fun when you tell people who you are and people make fun of you and expect everything to be changed just because of that little aspect it is so stupid okay like stop with the stereotypes Stop with the bullying. Like, okay, I'm just fed up with bullying. Today, we have a school play. All the kids, okay, well, so they had this documentary video at the beginning of the play of all the hard work that all the kids did in the play. And so, and then some kid comes on and he's wearing a lot of makeup because he's playing Jacob Marley. And that's a character that's a ghost. So it needs a lot of makeup. And they all laugh at the screen because they're all idiots and they're ignorant and they don't appreciate the arts. And now all my teachers are saying, oh, well then I guess we shouldn't have Romeo and Juliet come to your school because all of the kids can't stop laughing at inappropriate parts. Okay, you know the second, you know the second, um, spirit? Okay, well, the second spirit had stuffing because the second spirit in the book and in the plays and everything is this big, big, like, kind of, 
um, hefty man with red robe on and holly in their hair. So the girl is really skinny, so she wore stuffing. And some kid shouts in the audience, Stand the Claws! when she comes out on the stage. And you can totally tell that the, the person who played the spirit was embarrassed, and the whole audience laughed. I swear to God, our eighth grade. It's, it's not fair, and it's just plain rude. So, you know what? Someone's being bullied or put down, or your friend comes up to you, and they're like, Hey, is that kid gay? You know what? You tell them what they're doing wrong, and that it's rude and insulting and bullying, because it is. And, honestly, I, I, I just... I think it's just stupid how a lot of people just laugh at things. And they know it's wrong to laugh at them. But they're like, that's hilarious. <laughs> they laugh at things just because, you know, bullying. It's the cool thing to do. And everyone's doing it. And everyone's laughing at it. <laughs> so it must be funny. But if you really don't think it's funny, and you see the hurt in that person's eyes, and you go, no, this isn't right, well, you say something. Because otherwise... You're still as much of a bully just standing there and not doing anything. Peace out. Darn. Stupid hangers all like, ow, I dropped one on my foot. Messing up my video.